I brought with me a simple everyday laundry clip. And you may think, wait, I came here to hear something about really cool science projects, not to be reminded of my laundry. But I will tell you how I use simple clips like these to prevent major bleedings in patients with polyps in their large intestines. I am a young doctor who is fascinated by your gut. So I was very happy when a couple of years ago, the government introduced the national screening program for bowel cancer. You may have heard of it. In the screening program, elderly people send a sample of their stool or poo to the lab where it gets tested for microscopic traces of blood, suggestive for polyps. Polyps are small bumps of tissue that grow on the inner lining of your large intestines and that normally shouldn't be there. They can be harmless, but they can also grow into bowel cancer. That is why a specialist bowel doctor or gastroenterologist needs to take a look inside your intestines and remove these polyps before they can grow into bowel cancer. They do this by inserting a long, thin scope with a camera on top through the anus into the intestines. With this, they can reach the polyp with sharp instruments with which they can cut it out. And you can compare this scope a little bit with a garden hose, but you don't have to worry, it's not that thick. <laughs> so, this sounds like a great technique to prevent bowel cancer, and it is. But let's remember that every operation has its complications as well. The, the wounds of one out of ten of the people who have large polyps removed this way will start to bleed. And this can happen even when the patient is already back home after the operation. These patients, don't, these patients don't feel so well, they get bowel cramps, and when they go to the toilet, they see the toilet water turn a bright red. Now, red is not good. So, while my colleagues are trying to cure these patients in the hospital, I do my part by trying to prevent these bleedings from happening in the first place. And that is actually where this clip comes in again. See, I investigate in a large group of patients if we can prevent these bleedings by closing the wounds afterwards with a couple of these clips. They will hold the wound shut for a couple of weeks, and then they will just fall off, and you will find them back in, uh, in the toilet. That is, if you look. So, that is how simple clips like these can help prevent major bleedings and make our healthcare system a little bit safer. Thank you.